my special interest is the pre-war car era, especially cars like La Gonda, Aston Martin, Alves and Invicta, as well as, of course, the lovely eight- and six-cylinder pre-war cars built by Mercedes and to have an Italian company, Alfa Romeo. Basically, my interest um, started by going backwards, actually, in time. So I was very much into the 60s when, when I started with my interest in cars, and then it developed back when I learned about the great engineering skills people had actually before World War II, and I was fascinated what they actually achieved by building those beautiful, lovely eight-cylinder cars. The most memorable car is actually a car we sold in Monaco in 2010. It was a 1937 BMW. 328mm Bugefalter, of course a pre-war car. This car is very memorable for me because it is a one-off car, it has a fantastic race history, and it is really a beautiful car. It is actually very easy to keep busy in the collector car hobby as there is an event almost every weekend during the year, beginning in end of January with our Arizona sale and going on until mid-November even. So what I do, I actually go and visit concours event as for example, the Concorso della Ganza Villa d'Este, or actually I take part in rallies as the Zivretta Classic or the Ensa Classic, mainly, of course, here on the mainland in Europe, mainly in Germany, Austria, and it's great fun. My market prediction for the coming year is that the collector car hobby will remain strong. We have a lot of interest, a new interest from new collectors all over the world, especially from Asia, China, and from Russia. And I am sure that um, the, the prices will remain strong. Especially great cars, meaning rare, extraordinary example with great provenance and documentation, will sell very, very well. Um, we have seen some very strong results for important historic Ferraris. I am sure this tendency will stay the same, if not even pick up this year. My advice to new collectors would be always go for cars you like. Don't ask the first question if it's a good investment. Just go with your gut feeling and what you like and what you love. Because my experience in the market is whatever you like, it's just a question of time. The car will come up and it's a good investment for you anyway because you love the car. Yes, my dog Eddie actually does do shotgun on the co-driver's seat of my Jaguar.